with no pesky Twilight Town or Hollow Bastion in the way, we can finally make our way to a world we've yet to see. The Pride Lands. Quite possibly the most anticipated world in the game for me. Let's head in. Hey, check us out. <laughs> this place is kind of creepy, though. Uh -huh. Oh. Heartless? Oh, I don't know, Sora. Oh, I get the feeling they might live here. Don't mind us. Just passing through a river being in trouble. Yeah, that's right. Don't be silly. We'd love you to stick around for lunch. Um, we didn't bring anything to eat. <laughs> that's not going to be a problem. <clears throat> Gorse, Sora. I think we're the lunch. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Going somewhere? Man, that scar's got the worst timing. Just let him roar. Eh, we better go see what he wants. Sounds like he's grumpy enough already. Ah, <sighs> fine. I don't know what that was about, but I'm glad it's over. <sighs> Everything's harder on four legs. Why do stop practicing? Well, I found a trick to it. Here, let me show you. And with that, Goofy teaches us the art of running on four legs so that we don't have, so we can avoid the tripping that we saw earlier. 
But here we are in the Pride Lands. The nature of this world has changed us into a lion cub. I don't know why cub. Um, at about this old, I would imagine that uh, we would be a full-grown lion, but whatever. I guess it's not as kawaii as, a, as Sora as a lion cub. Um, so, I have a couple issues with this world, and I have um, a lot of things that I like about this world. Uh, for one, I like Lion Sora. I think yeah. it adds something to the gameplay. It makes it a little different. You have yeah. to get used to how to fight in this world. Uh, yeah. Sora tends to go forward a lot. Um, did we? Oh, we did get a new. We did get a new Keyblade, so I should grab that. We got the Decisive Pumpkin, which gives us a combo boost. One of the better uh, Keyblades in the game. Um, and I think that was it. We also got new abilities as a lion. We can only use these as a lion. So these are our abilities. And then Donald got Jackpot. Which is alright. Uh, so, let's head forward, I guess. What is it? Well, we're gonna have to learn how to defend ourselves, being on all fours like this. I bet there are lots of moves we can do that we normally couldn't. He's got that right. We got a whole slew of new combos and moves. If Kairi saw you like this, I bet she'd think you were cute. Oh, okay. I guess our drive clothes transformed us. I'm not sure how that works, but I like to think it's more the nature of the world that changed us, because Goofy and Donald changed, and they don't have drive clothes on. So... Make more sense if the world changed us, not not the other way around. Or not to uh, be changed. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Huh, what? What do we do? Stay back! Oh god, this is a really tough fight. So these guys deal a lot of damage, and um, it's not fun. Ow, ow, ow. But this is fun. Get closer to him, and hit him real hard. <laughs> oh, I missed. There we go, got him. I right, probably won't have to deal as much with their crap now. Oh, but I have to deal with that. Rodeo! Yeah! And there goes his head. It looks like he lost his head. Oh, man. Definitely heartless. Thank you. You really saved me. We're just glad you're okay. Did you see any other Heartless around here? Heartless? Is that what they're called? I'm not sure if there are any others. I don't usually hunt outside the Pride Lands. Pride Lands? Hey, do you know if a guy named Riku is there? Or some bad guys in black hoods? Or maybe this really big bully named Pete? Ah. <sighs> Oh well, we might as well go take a look anyway. Wait, the Pride Lands are dangerous. Scar and the hyenas have made things unbearable for everyone. There's no food left. They've driven off the prey. We're about to starve. We can handle a little danger. You just saw us beat those Heartless, didn't you? I guess you're right. You could be just what the Kingdom needs. Maybe you can help us. You mean take on this Scar guy and all those hyenas? Scar? He took over when our last king, Mufasa, died. So you're saying this guy's your king? You want us to take down your king? Wait just a minute. We can't just go around knocking kings off their thrones. Then again, 
If they see that I'm stronger than their king, maybe they'll ask me to be their next king. Sora? <laughs> I'd have to refuse, of course. Still, I'd like to see the Pride Lands, so you guys don't mind lending them a paw, do you? She's gonna go on ahead and tell the other lionesses. We're supposed to meet her at a place called Pride Rock. Oh, I just can't wait to make Sora King. Gonna beat these heartless. Gonna ruin their day. Uh, so, one thing you may have noticed already is that there is a, um, terrible, sev terribly severe lack of music in this world. Not in the overworld or when you're fighting, but rather, um, oh shoot, so close, I can make that. Oh no! Maybe I have to attack. I'm gonna get this puzzle piece, oh. Oh, hey, guys. Um, but there is there is a really bad, severe lack of music um, in this world, um, particularly in the cutscenes. Um, the combat and, you know, overworld, there's not that much, but here there's definitely a lot of cutscenes. There's a lot of lacking music. Um, for instance, the opening where we saw the Wildebeest Stampede, they didn't play the Wildebeest Stampede music, and I'm not sure why, because, I mean, especially when they remade the game in HD, I don't think it's impossible for them to have gotten the original soundtrack. I don't think that that would be out of the realm of possibility. They were able to do that for the Pirate's World, they went back and they picked up the rights to play the original soundtrack in this game, either that or they redid it in-house, in which still wouldn't be hard for them to do with the Wildebeest Stampede song. But adding music would make this world a lot less sterile than it already is, and unfortunately this... Or, uh, is sterile is the right word? I'm not sure. Um, but unfortunately this world suffers from that, and um, you know, as much as I like this world and uh, what it means to me, it's it's just ah, uh, they, they really needed to add music um, very much so, it would have improved this world leagues above what it is now um, now another thing that's a big problem is that this world has a lot of open areas, as you're seeing right here pride lands are huge um and they did it because of Sora's increased mobility and speed while as a cub. Which makes sense. But... The problem is it leads to, visit, to uh, sceneries like this. And I understand this is at the point where the Pride Lands are supposed to be dry and Scar's running everything into the ground. But this is boring to look at. Like, this is really not good scenery. And the way that they could have fixed that is by either making the the uh, sections either more vertical, which I guess wouldn't make sense with with the savanna, considering it's supposed to be really really flat, or maybe have some roaming NPCs or more varied enemies. Perhaps include hyenas as enemies instead of just heartless. Um. I don't know, there's some problems like that, where... Come on, come on, come on. I got a rodeo. Oh god. Woo! Oh god. Oh, there we go. He stops moving. And there goes your head. dead. I get a frost crystal. But they, uh, there, there's some glaring problems like I've pointed out so far, and there's some other problems that I'll explain later. Um, 
One of them being that most of the cast did not return when, um, I mean, I think they got, I think they got the, vo the official voice matches from Disney, which I guess is good enough. Um, but this movie was recent enough that I think they could have gotten some more people that were original or Disney could have done it. Although there were some really high, high name actors in Lion King. Um, God, I forget who the who was that played Simba right now. I'll I'll remember it later, but off the top of my head, I don't remember. Uh, so you know what? Let's just go to Pride Rock after all this fighting, and we'll can. Oh, hey guys! And right, we'll continue with the world. Just I need to. I'll explain it to you guys what what I think is some issues, some more issues as we continue uh, with the world. What is it? I told Rafiki you might be able to help us force Scar and the hyenas out of the Pride Lands. But he says it won't work. You see, whoever saves the Pride Lands will be our next king, and he has to have the right qualities. Meaning? Well, I think she means you're not cut out for the job, Sora. <sighs> I'm sorry you came all this way. Hey, no, it's okay. You better go before Scar finds out you're here. I'm really sorry. Yeah, we should probably go... I mean, Scar's right around the corner, I imagine. And we should probably get out of here before things get a little hectic, right? I think we should get going right after I see the view. Huh? Is this view? Yeah, this view's gray. Just like I thought it would be. Alright. Whoop! I'm not gonna make it! I'm not gonna make it! Oh, I made it! I got the sunset puzzle piece. Alright. Yeah, let's go. Don't want Scar to beat us up. Snack! Snack? Nah! Mm -mm. We got us a three cost <laughs> meal! Look at that! Here comes Scar, the king! <laughs> ah, and Pete! If I were you, I'd be more worried about my friends. Sorry! We're surrounded! Go on, ladies. You've got some hunting to do. The herds have moved on, Scar. We can't hunt in a land with no prey. No prey? Then what do you call this? We're not prey. Oh, nice and fresh, too. Well, they're all yours, Scar. Follow me! 